run out of formaldehyde. I underestimated you. You almost caught me in flagrante delicto. Now you've seen through my bluff with Nathaniel. Although, you've not divined all, I see. Had you, you would have drawn your silver sword. Who, what are you? A vampire. Higher, of course. Got a reason for killing? A reason to torture? Hmm. I thought you'd figure that out as well. The symbolism's rather obvious. Coals for those who are blind to the fire. The egg of a salamander born of fire to replace their cold, doubting hearts. Fire down the throat that... Yeah, symbolism's clear. What's not is why a vampire would kill in the name of the eternal fire. Should be equally obvious. I concur with the Church's diagnosis. Novigrad is a fallen city. Its population amnesiacs to the very concepts of decency and morality. So I decided to remind them, in a manner they'd be certain to notice. There are other ways. Could have set up a soapbox in Hierarch Square, preached from it. How funny. That's exactly what I did. But none listened. Instead they laughed. Through stones. Give a thought to my victims. A lecherous woodcarver who'd spend his last copper on whores. An old countess who defiled symbols of the faith. A Trebirates for whom nothing was sacred, nothing above ridicule. They did not deserve to live. But their deaths could be a lesson to others. Awaken them, scare them onto the correct path, the path to the fire, to cleansing, to salvation. For you, I'm afraid it's too late. You are a man of little faith. I sense this. Mm-hmm. But I'm pretty good with a sword. Pretty good. Might not cut it. Oh, come on! 